Mount Everest Sherpa guides issued an ultimatum to the Nepalese government Sunday. Greater compensation for the victims' families or will cancel climbing season. 350 Sherpa guides say they will not lead any more expeditions up Mount Everest this year. The move is to honor 16 fellow guides killed by an avalanche this week. Rescuers today called off the search for three remaining guides. The deadly avalanche occurred Friday as the Sherpas were carrying equipment up the mountain. The Weather Channel has more on the tragedy in Nepal. The avalanche happened between the base and Camp 1 in an area called the Kumbu Icefall. It is the first major hurdle on the mountain. This is where the Sherpas were climbing Friday morning under vast walls of ice that suddenly came loose. Time reports the Sherpa guides, staff and climbers met Sunday to construct a list of demands for their government with a seven-day expiration date, including greater compensation for the mourning families. The New York Times reports the Nepal Mountaineering Association is pushing for $1,041 per family instead of the $408 currently promised. If their demands are not met, more than 330 expeditions could be canceled. This puts the Nepalese government in a tough position. If those trips are canceled, it must reimburse the climbers for their permits, which according to Time cost about $10,000 per permit. At least one expedition has already been called off. Discovery Network has canceled plans for live wingsuit jump from the summit, which was scheduled for May 11th. CNN says the Nepalese government makes $3 million from royalties alone per spring climbing season. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Andrews.